people on Instagram. Trying to get live on Facebook, folks. Sorry about the delay there. I was returning some videotapes. So, here we go. Um, counts from the couch. Uh, if anybody saw my Instagram story, I did want to let you guys know that we are going to move this to kind of a uh, twice a month type deal on Thursday night still, 5 p.m., but just kind of going every other week. Um, you know, I just don't like stuff. I don't want it to get stale. You know what I mean? I want it to be fresh for you guys, and I feel like um, sometimes it's kind of, uh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. We'll see what it see what it does for us. Make it more interesting. It's more rare. It's gonna be harder to find. Thank you guys for jumping in. Those of you that are. Um, and for some reason, Facebook was messing up last week, or, or maybe the week before. I couldn't see comments. So if I'm not responding to your comments, it's not that I don't like you or that I don't want to respond. Um, it's that I simply can't hear you. Can't see you. Can't see the message. So that's all it is. Um. What to start with this week? Let's see. Uh, man, this is a new one I wrote this week. Um, with Josh Dunn and Neil Mason. Um, some of you might know Neil Mason as the um, the drummer for the Caddy the Caddy Three. They're one of the Cadillac Three guys. Those guys are just cool as shit, and I wish I could be cool as shit. We wrote this song together. I love those guys, and I hope you enjoyed it. It's called Think It's Sober. It was Josh's title, and I'm so grateful that he brought it into the co-write. It's pretty rough, um, but I'm still going to play it, and let me know if you like it. Hey, Tina, uh, thanks for jumping on. Um, hey, right back at you. Here we go. So, uh, new song, new song alert, Think It's Sober. Says just ignore you. Half of me's happy to hear your voice, and all of me knows it's nothing new. Couple drinks make you think you don't want to be lonely. Couple more, and you at my door, and I don't mind. Your whiskey tips, you drinking, thinking it ain't over. Hell, I just wish that you could think it's sober. Some kind of energy. Real cool. Da, 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 da. You think by now my common sense of no loving you's got consequences, so why is it so easy to let you back in? Sight of you in the morning light, just when I start to think you might stick around this time, that's when you're gone again. Two days ago. So 
Um, I don't know. It's kind of weird. Um, but uh, yeah, Chad Croson, you're welcome for the free beer. I got to get people in here, man. I got to false advertise, bro. Free tacos, free beer. <laughs> Oh, man. Well, thank you guys for joining in. If you have any questions, as usual, you have any comments, just throw them at me. Um, I'm happy to field any of those. Hey, Miss Linda Long, Jimmy Ritchie, Joan Williams, thank you guys for jumping in here. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Severe thunderstorm morning, just in case anybody was wondering. It just popped up on my phone. You heard it here first, folks, on Counts from the Couch. News, songs, and a greasy-faced man singing and answering questions. Thank you guys for jumping in here. Well, like I said, just as more people are trickling in, we are moving Counts from the Couch uh, to kind of a bi-weekly is, is what I think they call it. I don't know. I'm not a scientist, but uh, bi-weekly, bi-monthly, uh, I think is how you say it. We're doing it twice a month. So however you want to cut the cookie, that's, um, that's how we're doing it. So uh, we're going to be on this week. Obviously, we're here, and now we're talking. We're hanging. Next week, we're going to be off, and then we'll be back the week after that. Just to let you guys know, uh, let's see... 
Josh Vaughn asks, does the guitar or song come first? I notice you use the whole fretboard in a lot of your songs, but I struggle putting words to the guitar. I've been a guitar player most of my life and new to songwriting. Uh, that's a great question, uh, Josh. Songwriters get that a lot. Uh, for me, I don't know if, like, I find that I am most creative when I'm working off like a vibe. Like, you know, with Dress Up, I kind of kind of brought that thing in. This guitar is all out of tune and sounding wonky, but you kind of bring in that little, um, just brought in that, like, what if you had like a lead thing that was meh, you know, just have some little vibe that you bring in. Um, and, and then we were like, okay, what does that sound like? Well, it sounds happy. It sounds like summer. It sounds like I love the girl. You know, it always goes back to a girl, I feel like. But um, yeah, so that's how that kind of comes out. I feel like I work best off of Vibe. I don't, some days you come in and you just have a killer title. Um, I remember Backseat Driver. That was a title that I had in my phone for um, a long time and it got into a co-write um, and we just weren't, we weren't kind of, it landed on anything is weird and so we all went to our phones oh let's see if we got a title you try a lot of different things and you know that day specifically you know backseat driver came up and we we're all like oh man that's cool what could that mean and then you just work off of that so it's i mean really you can get there um uh anyway i mean a different day different group of people you know you come in and you got a guitar slinger you're obviously going to say play something sick on the guitar and let's see if we all can get inspired um but i don't know it's just it's different every, every, every way. I just say you gotta just start putting words to music and something will come out. Um, but great question, Josh. Thanks, man. Uh, greetings from Michelle Phillips, Tiffany. Thank you uh, guys for chiming in there. We got people jumping on, all right. What do we wanna play next? Let's see, I'm gonna play you a little cover song. A little song I was kind of working up today. I think, I think uh, live shows are kind of opening back up a little bit. We've had some offers come in. We've had. Um, I'm, I'm kind of working on doing something here locally. I'm obviously based in Nashville. I'm from Franklin, and so for any of you guys that are close, we're going to be doing some stuff at the local. Um, the local down on West End is a really cool little spot. Um, we're looking at like every other Wednesday, just you know, from here until the fall. Just, just we're gonna have a, a standing gig there that just people can come hang out, come listen to music and just, uh, yeah, just drink. Uh, Michelle Phillips Tiffany, Tiffany says, bi-weekly has never made sense. I don't know who invented that. I vote bi-monthly. Yeah, I was in a meeting today and we were discussing it and they said bi-weekly and bi-monthly is the same thing. And so I was like, I don't see how that could be possible, but I'll take your word for it. I don't get it. So I just say, you know, every, uh, I just say every, uh, you know, twice a month. So, yeah. Yeah, we're going to have it twice a month, bi-monthly. Um, yeah, the, uh, and yeah, Jimmy Richie's asking, full band, the shows in Nashville that are at the local, if anybody is local, um, these shows, um, yeah, Linda Long says, she sure hopes so, needs some live music. Those shows are going to be full band. We're kind of getting the band back together. We're getting the band back together. <laughs> And we're going to learn, uh, relearn all the songs, and we're going to play for about an hour and a half, and it'll be a great time. Um, so if you want to hear us sounding good, maybe come the second week. Um, if you don't care, you know, come the first week. Um, hey, Lana Anderson. Uh, so yeah, it'll be good. Full band shows, the local Nashville. We're looking at uh, Wednesdays, probably starting the first week of June. I'm obviously going to post something on my socials, so y'all keep, y'all be on the lookout for that. Yeah, that'd be great. He was raised on a tractor in overalls and boots. Went to college and then law school since leaving his roots. He came home in a Lexus. He left in a Ford Country ain't country no more Well, he told his daddy Catch up with the times Nowadays people trade Heifers online Dad ain't 
ain't sailing deals with a handshake like before. Country ain't country no more. Now. No more. One of my favorite by Mr. Travis Tritt. Thank you guys for jumping on here. Um, local from the local uh, title, Mr. Jimmy Rich is throwing out at us. I like it. I like it, folks. You heard it here first. Local from the local. I'm a local. I'm from Franklin, Tennessee, and we're going to be doing on a series, uh, putting on a series of uh, full band shows. Now that we're all back at it, we're all healthy. We're feeling good. Uh, we're needing to work our way out of our depression and our funk. Um, yeah, local from the local. We might call that. So be on the lookout for that. Um, uh, Kristen Duarte, you're a local, so you should definitely be at all the shows. That's a silly question. Thank you. Come again. Uh, Lana, I hope you can make one of them for sure. Um, Kristen, I know you know Jimmy, bro. I know that. You don't need to throw that in the chat, man. I know you guys are old friends. <laughs> Uh, all right, let's see. What do we got here? What was another one I wanted to do? do, 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 do. Let's see. <clears throat> Man, anybody else having some allergy issues? I've been having them all day. Let's see.
Don't kill nothing that you ain't gonna eat. You learn from the dirt what the street can't teach. That backwood for lies of feet. Hell, it still means a lot to me. Even though I know I'm just a red neck sitting on a screen, dance, living on a long neck. Listen to the cricket sing the same old song. Jumping on, I'm gonna grab this other guitar, play a few more for you. Um, like I said, uh, if anybody else is new or jumping in, we're doing counts on the couch, uh, bi-weekly or bi-monthly. I don't know what it means, but we're gonna move it to uh, twice a month. So it's gonna be every other Thursday. Um, yeah, and so they're looking forward to it. TC McPappy jumping on, baby. Uh, hope your your house building dude is going good, man. We were talking about that the last time we were hanging out. I hope that's working out for you. That house looks incredible. TC, for everyone who doesn't know, is building his dream house. Dream log cabin that he always wanted. It's just beautiful. Um, I'll play a, one I haven't ever released. Uh, but one that's just really close to my heart. This was kind of when I was... Um, in a particularly honest um, part of my songwriting time, and I, I wrote this song called Dear Life. Um, yeah, and it, I actually wrote it when I was 28, and I just had a birthday. I'm 32 now. Thank you, guys. Thank you, thank you. That means a lot. Uh, but this song is called Dear Life, and I mentioned that I wrote it when I was uh, 28 because I, there's a line in there that says that I was 28, so... I don't want you to guys think I'm still a youngster. I'm an old man now. I know it and you know it. So here we go. This is Dear Life. Hope you enjoy it. Um, yeah. Haven't played in a while, so if I mess it up, sorry. Been waking up too early to be staying out this late Wondering if I'm half of me, I thought I'd be at 28 Does my mama proud? Does my daddy doubt? That I'll ever be something more than old guitars and tip jobs on the stage Dust on a diploma, rust on the family name Oh, hell, I don't know But it's lonely on my own Dear life, do you remember When I had you figured out Those days are over Now I'm older and you're all I think about You used to tell me it'd be easy To be anything I want So won't you tell me why Most the time it feels like I'm just holding on for 
daylight. Second window on the left, second brick house on the street. On a bunk bed with my brother talking about how cool it'd be to be all grown up. Now here we are and we ain't talked in months. Dear life, do you remember when I had you figured out? Those days are over now. I'm older and you're all I think about. You used to tell me it'd be easy to be anything I want. So won't you tell me why? Most the time it feels like I'm just holding. And the thrills I used to chase are now the faces of my fears. Dear life, do you remember when I had you figured out those days are over? Now I'm older and you're all I think about. You used to tell me it'd be easy to be anything I want, so won't you tell me why? Most of the time. It feels like I'm just holding on. Oh, it feels like I'm just holding on. It feels like I'm just holding on for dear life. Dear life, folks, it's getting pretty ominous outside in, in Franklin, and I'm sitting right by a window. Uh, I don't know if that's the smartest thing to be doing, but um, yeah, that was Dear Life. Thank you guys um, for, uh, for uh, loving that song, and yeah, um, cool. Uh, I'm probably going to jump off of here just because it's looking kind of weird, and I think my power is getting a little patchy. But thank you guys so much for jumping on this week. Like I said, we're going to be back in two weeks uh, live at five counts from the couch. You guys are awesome. Thank you so much for listening and I hope you have a great week. See ya.